I threw on one of my most favorite sewing makes and I headed to San Diego. out and about in San Diego, California, and I am going hiking and I am so excited. I love being outdoors. Have you ever made something and you're like, what did I do before I had this in my life? That is this Sherpa sweatshirt. Mm -hmm. I wear this thing like all the time. When I need to go out, I just throw this thing on in a heartbeat. It's nice and warm, keeps me cozy, and I just love it. So I'm gonna share with you a little bit of this hiking trip and I hope you enjoy and then I have a sewing make to share with you which is a dress that I will talk about in a little bit so for the meanwhile this is the scene that I am checking out look at all the little flowers growing or are they weeds we're checking out the trail just to see where it leads us and all that good stuff We are at Annie's Canyon Trail and I'm not sure what to expect. Never been here before. As we have reached the area that has such a beautiful view. Look at this. Wow. So cool. This is so cool. tell you a little bit about my next sewing make it is a vogue dress it is vogue 1777 and i made it out of denim fabric there are quite a bit of details in the dress so there are pockets and the pockets have a welt on them so they're welt pockets and then it's a crisscross front there are pleats in the front pleats in the back and then there are darts in the bodice the bodice is fully lined and I made this twice. So the first time I made it, I had trouble with the welt pockets and I had to do something different the second time. When I get home, I will show you what I did to make the welt pocket work. So now we have to trek all the way back down and then I will put on my dress and show you what it looks like on. Okay, so here is the dress. I used a denim fabric that I found from Joanne Fabrics. The lining is a cotton fabric, also from Joann's. The sleeves are cuffed, so you just fold the fabric up and tag it down. I decided to use a few little scraps in the sleeve area, which is the darker denim. And this pattern is rated as easy. I shortened the dress by 11 inches, so I just cut off 11 inches from the pattern hem. And I have a denim jacket that has a belt. Well, I decided to take that belt and just tie it around this dress. It happened to match pretty well. And I like the dress better with the belt.
okay so you take the pocket lining and you stitch it to the skirt front and then you have a welt piece this is your welt piece and then you take your fashion fabric the pocket piece and you're going to sew it down next to your welt piece and then when you get to this part you're going to fold everything back press it open and then you're going to slash down the middle to create the welt once all that was complete you have something that looks like this this is the right side of the fashion pocket piece this is the wrong side of the lining piece but you're going to have to put this piece with this piece to sew right sides together but as you can see in the picture these two pieces are not going to come together because you have this seam in the way so when i made the dress the second time i ended up replacing this piece with another welt so i ended up cutting out four welt pieces to make this work and then when it came time to put the pocket together i just sewed the pocket the fashion pocket onto the side edge here and then i was able to put the right sides together no problem so before i go i want to leave you with a love share about sam's club now at sam's club there's a letter code on each price tag so the code will be either an n an a or a c so n stands for never out so that means the items will always be in stock a means active so it's saying that they have plenty of those items in stock if you see an a and a C means canceled, so the item is not going to be restocked.